Hello fellow geocachers and welcome to our video today where we will be going geocaching in Oxshot Heath to hopefully get a good set of geocaches. We'll see you Here we are looking for a cache which the hint says MTT which is an abbreviated word for a multi-trunk tree. So there are actually quite a few around as you look. So we're going to have a quick look at all the MTTs we can find and see if there are any caches around them. So, right here, we have our multi-trunked tree. Now, we go around to the back of it, as we always do, and here we have it, the cache. It's a little damp, the, the log book, but it's still there and it's fine. So we'll just log that now. So here, our hint was a sticky silver birch near some holly. So, if we just have a little look i think this looks appropriate and we'll come this looks rather strange i'd say not in place and here we have it our geocache so we must be very careful in finding this cache as there is a lot of traffic around as you will see so we must get it when the traffic is moving but we believe we've got it Right here, I must be careful. Just in there. And here we have it. Nice camouflage. So, we have to be very careful there, as there were a lot of muggles around. Loads of cars, lots of people walking, dogs coming out for a nice walk in the woods. So, we have to be very careful. Luckily, we got it, logged it, and now we're off to the next one. I do not know why. But this cache seemed to take us a long time looking around for a Millennium base and looking for a small black pot on the ground. But it was just here all along. However, it was covered by quite a lot of leaves and took us a while actually, unfortunately. What do you think of these stones? Is there an image that pops to your head? Well, if you thought a rocky beach, then you were correct, because that was exactly what the hint was. And here, if we turn over this rock, we have our cache. I am about to ascend this tree to grab what looks like an amazing cache. That is our cache, just there. What a great cache. So I'm gonna have to climb that up now. It's a fairly easy climb, I guess. Here's the logbook, but fairly damp, as you can see, so we can't write on this. And this is how high up I am. There's mum down there, rocky. Here is my bird, just here. Look at it, it's amazing. Now, to get down. Our clue was a dead tree stump near some holly. And here we have it. Just look closely, there's our camouflage box. And we'll just grab it now, see what's inside. So here we have 
a very big geocache with two tracker boys inside. This one started in USA and is aiming to get all around the world. So we're going to take this and hopefully place it at a cache near Heathrow Airport so someone else can pick it up and take it across the world hopefully to a new country that's not been to. This trackable here wants to get to Devon or is travelling across the all of UK. So we're going to leave this one here but we'll take this one. So we were at a park near the airport as you can hear. So we are just going to pop this trackable just here into one of the geocaches and hopefully somebody else can pick it up and move it to somewhere else. So we are just putting the trackable in now and we shall leave it here and hopefully somebody can pick it up and take it to a new country. We have signed the logbook and we're about to put it back. Well, that is the end of our video. I sure hope you did enjoy it. I definitely enjoyed some of the geocaches we did today. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, click that notifications bell. That is Rocky Runners out.